Leave Uzbekistan. That is my request to you, and that is my testament. Don't remain part of Uzbekistan. I do not know what will become of me or whether I will return. This is what Lulago Kalikanova, a journalist and blogger, said in a video she posted to her social media right before she disappeared on July 1st, 2022. In the days leading up to her disappearance in July, Kelly Canova was sharing her criticisms towards the president's proposal that would revoke the Karakal Pakistan region's autonomy. Kelly Canova was detained by the authorities for seven months. In the first several weeks of her detainment, she had no contact with her family, leaving her sister with only the word fine from authorities as the only sign of her survival. She was officially charged with organizing mass riots, planning to overthrow constitutional order, and distributing materials that contained threats to public security. On January 31st, 2023, Uzbekistan found Kalikanova guilty of the charges filed against her, and she was sentenced to three years probation. The charges are clear violations of Kalikanova's right to freedom of speech and expression. The Human Rights Foundation found no comments in her posts leading up to the days of the protests that could be justly criminalized under international law. Thankfully, she was given a leaner sentence than she originally expected, which could have been upwards of seven to eight years of prison. However, while she is in Uzbekistan and under probation, her human rights are still under attack. We must stay vigilant and continue to denounce the actions of the Uzbekistan government and protect the rights of journalists. No journalist should worry if speaking the truth or doing their job will send them to prison. Thank you.